So when the MVI line of amplifiers launch, we'll also have a new version of our tune software that opens up the connection points for MVI. There's some nice changes to the new tune software as well. Since in many cases a boat is probably being tuned outside in the sun, we've changed our tune software and we give you now the option to use a high contrast uh, mode. What that means is we now have a nice bright white background, sky blue font and lines that really makes it easy to see when we're making adjustments in a brighter environment. In terms of functionality, if you've been using our VXI or Tweet products, you'll have no issue jumping into the deep end with Tune for MBI. Really, the big changes deal with the signal routing. As we mentioned, we have the extra pre-outs down here that have DSP. On this case, at the uh, MV600 slash 6i, we have three pairs of pre-outs that we can adjust and a nice bright screen that makes it a lot easier to see. One of the other nice features is on the network tab. If we're using the MVI hub to create a network of amplifiers, we can easily pick the amp that we want to adjust, but we can make now system-wide or network-wide uh, controls. Every amplifier still has its own project, but what's cool about this is you can do everything without plugging into a single amplifier, plug into the hub, click net transfer network and it'll transfer everything to the appropriate amplifier. So if we're doing systems where we're repeating the system, we do a boat, we do you know certain MVI amplifiers, we tune it. If we replicate that system, all we have to do is put the amps in the boat, hook them up to the hub, plug our computer into the hub, hit transfer and it flashes all of the amplifiers at the same time, which is really, really cool. And one of the benefits of the new protocol found in the MVI hub and MBI side of our tune software. Mm -hmm.